Get some good, good mileage off of that race drive. Knee, we know he's a phenomenal player, legendary, legendary Tekken player, but today he's been looking a little bit shaky in places. Yeah, I, mean, I don't know if that's because of the off season or what. Yeah, I have no idea. But I would not be surprised if he can go all the way to the top of the tournament and end up taking. I mean, it could. I mean, yeah, he could lose right now or he could win the tournament. It's literally, you know, it's literally that wide. Oh, and there's an amazing low parry. It's looking more like Who the latter. Who does that? Who opens up with the low parry like that? <laughs> I mean, if against that? Eddie, he had to read. Oh, and there's a back two catches him out of the low there. Okay, nice. Gets a punish. All right. Okay, keeping it safe. Down for once. Down, down for and down for once. Yeah, I believe this is going to be the last match of the day, but we will try to get an update for you guys and let you guys know what is expected for our top eight. Ooh. Obviously, this battle is for top eight for tomorrow. It really is. Yeah, this is really important. Now, loser goes home. Winner goes to top eight. That was interesting. He didn't get the combo that yeah. he wanted. What happened there? Whoa, Wait, what's oh, he doing? Oh, 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 my God. Is he crazy? He baited him in for that. He wanted him to come in so he could get the back two. That was nuts. He, Abel Del Maestro. He is oh. living on the edge. Oh, and he takes the round with the low. I still, I'm, I'm like, I'm blown away oh that he did that. Oh my goodness, he stole it away there with that key charge into back two, baiting him in. Knee taking it. And there's another nice low parry. Knee getting some damage. Great conversion. Oh, doesn't get all of it though. Doesn't get all of that combo. Weird hit, weird. Uh, I can't believe he did that. Yeah. I'm still like, <laughs> I'm a loss for words. You're shocked. <laughs> I'm sure that's going to get clipped. And there's a forward four, that forward thrust kick. Yep, straight to the wall. All right. So the down back two, two, three, and he is rinsing those down fours. Back two, one. Oh, oh he, he's, he's getting. Yeah, he knew he was desperate. He's getting a big greedy there. Went for something big. Access denied though. Knee looking good. Ties it up one, one. And we're just going for the electric wind hook fist. In forward further. four. Ooh. Abel Del Maestro got the first round, but can he get another? Knee looking a lot sharper now. He's kind of. He's kind of latched onto a few of the ideas that Abadil Maestro likes to go for. And Nii is not someone you can get away with things more than once on. He will download you in a second. There's another forward four. Oh, Electric oh. Winterfist. Great, great read there. Uh-oh, but the spring kick able to get away from the wall, which is key. Oh, yes. You got him out there. He's not going to get a full uh -oh. combo, but he's going to get a lot damage. of damage. Oh, nice block there. There's the rage drive. Oh, goes for the bamboo splitter. It's blocked. Oh, oh my goodness. That's it? That's it for oh sure. My oh my goodness. Gosh. Great read there with the down for two launch. He is at the lead. I can't believe what we're seeing. Some clutch gameplay from Abel Del Maestro from Peru. And the thing is here, what we're seeing is, you know, this is probably one of Eddie's worst matchups in the game. I too. mean, he's playing it phenomenally well yeah. right now. And he, he went into it knowing that. Yeah. He went straight to Eddie when he saw Jin as well. He was confident with the pick. Yeah. Okay. okay this time he blocks it. Yes. Screw attack going over to the wall here. Yep. Oh, no. He put the brakes on on the Savage Sword there. Why, why did not. Why did he complete Maybe he wanted to keep him there for those. Maybe, yeah, for the mix up. Yep. Yeah. Goes for that clutch down for two that he won the last round with. Again, still just chilling. Yep, electric wheel hook fist. That here takes the round. This is an even game. Don't know who's going to go up 1 0 here. Match number one, final oh. round. Who wants it more? Oh, he oh, gets him, but oh, he's out of no, range. He doesn't get all of. Not what you like to see. That was an expensive mistake. I mean, it just was weird. It was like out of range. It's like he couldn't get it. And he is mixing knee up here, forcing him to guess between those mids and lows. Yeah, he wants the ball standing one there. Trying to just, you know, poke his head and see if he's able to hit. <laughs> Oop. Knees. He, he, does not, he does not fall for pressure like that. It's very, you, you can't condition a person like he. No. He's just too experienced for that. Oh, oh, uh -oh this is big. This, this is, is looking huge. good. Knee now in some trouble here. Who's going to get the next hit? Oh, oh no break! It. He got it. One there was more, no one break more on that. Why? And the down four closes down. Abel Del Maestro is going to be kicking himself that he didn't break that throw. Oh, that is so unfortunate. And you can see there, he is not happy with that. Oh, you got to be feeling for Del Maestro now. That yeah, was... That sucks. Oh, but man. man what he was so close. What an action-packed first match between these two. Wow. I did not expect it to be such a seesaw opening. So the winner guys. of this match will be going into the loser's bracket top eight to fight off against Chikuru. Well, not the winner of this match. I mean, if Del Maestro ties it up, would you go to 1-1? One, one? I'm sorry. The winner of this set. The winner of this set, bad. indeed. Yes, yes, definitely. And yes, Nina waving in, forcing him to respect the movement. There's a demon paw. Oh, threatening with that electric wind hook fist. I mean, we saw it in the last match. Abel de definitely does, has what it takes, yep. but he's going to have to overcome this matchup. Really and does. this player. <laughs> going for that forward four. Okay. Oh, we're running three out of the wave dash. Plus frames. Nice block there. Another demon four. He's slowly conditioning him, pushing him towards the wall. 
just a testament to Nii's knowledge. I mean, he knew going into this matchup that he was going to fight either I mean, Eddie or Liza, and yeah. he was just confident with this character matchup. And just look at that pristine conditioning. He just gave Dale, he gave Dale Master nothing in that round. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's oh, been, oh my goodness, and it's starting to add up. It's really starting to. He is opening him up. Starting to make excellent use of, the, of Alex with Hocus, which is such a detriment to a lot of the matchups here, especially with Eddie can only go backwards, right? Yeah. He can only go backwards. Okay, well, back to covers a lot of ground against yeah. a lot of the options here. Very, very strong move. Safe mid. Can delay the one. Get a lot of things off that. And the thing here is, like, you know, Abel, he's, he can go for lows, right? But yeah. I mean, he doesn't really have a, an option otherwise. Oh, oh my that's going to be it. That was a ridiculous read. Oh, wait, he dropped. He doesn't get all the combo, and there's the race drive. Oh, he oh, knew. Oh, and knee just oh, too small. Oh. oh, no. How does this happen? Drops on drops on drops. Knee won the round twice in a row there. He won the round twice. Let it go twice, and Dan Maestro will be happy to steal that one away. I mean, sometimes you know they say luck is a skill. You can't afford to give away too many of those, though. It will add up in the end. Yeah, it gets the wall. All right. Savage, so Nii, no. back in control momentarily. Again, he's been poking away, using a lot of that damage, yep. too. Whatever he has an opportunity, sides up four. He's been getting a lot of damage from those down fours. They've been chipping away, doing some great damage. Mason spent the race drive early here, and that's good for Nii. He doesn't have to worry about that anymore. Demon Paul. Oh man, this is tough. Runs in for the follow-up while running three. Looking for the close. Del Maestro though, fighting back. Oh, and there's the down four, and it is set point to knee. Yeah, knee takes this. He is gonna move on and secure himself a top eight placement. But Abel has a chance. I mean, it's just gonna be very, very tough here at oh, this juncture. Oh man, he is ready for every low, but he's been scaring him with the high wind hook fist, with the forward force. He does not want to do anything that's mid and slow. So he's been opting for the low attacks, but Nii, just so prepared, has been powering every one of them. Oh yeah. And he's looking really good right now. I mean, he has his back to the wall. This is looking really good for Nii. The positioning and just everything that's going for him here. Yeah. Abel's gonna have to take so many risks. He here. needs he needs a miracle right now. He needs something big. Oh, did you and see he's that? He's not gonna get it. The up forward four, and that is gonna close it out probably. One more hit. Oh, the uh -oh. double, double noggin. It's got to happen now. He does have race drive. And Not he maxed dead. up again. Are what you are we going to see? Oh. oh! The Domowashi able to end it there. And he decided that he was not going to oh. let any nonsense happen.